mean, he loved being with the Phillies because, uh, I mean, he, he had his success with the, with the Metropolitans, but uh, not like uh, the love he had uh, with being with Philadelphia. That, that, that's, such a, that's such a great thing because that, that team, that, that era of Philly mm-hmm. should have won quite a few times. They should have won not just 1980, they yeah. should have won 77, 78, 79. But, um, okay, so uh, we'll, we'll stop. Jen Bridge said, uh, <laughs> uh, she said, I can relate. My grandmother was a huge Phillies fan. She died uh, before seeing them win the second World Series. Uh, so that, that was tough. Yeah. That, for me, the most exciting year was the 93 Phillies. I mean, that was... Stacy oh, just Mad love for 93 Phillies. In, in 1993, I, was, mm-hmm. I got very sick. Um, I got severe mono and my liver shut down. And I was in recuperation for, I think, it was like, I was, it was like a four-month period. <clears throat> Excuse me. And it was during that time that the Phillies were awesome. Mm-hmm. So I'd be in bed watching these games at four o'clock in the morning, mm-hmm. and it was it was so bittersweet. And I oh man, mm-hmm. they never should have. You know, they went seventeen and five in eight. Yeah, that's what made that so amazing. But anyway, I'm going on before them. <laughs> Listener numbers are dropping. Uh, <laughs> but but uh, joining us in studio tonight, Tom Hyatt, Simon Godfrey. Do you guys want to do one more thing here before we? Uh, 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 yeah, if you want. We'll go yeah. grab my axe. Yeah, I mean, do, you, do you want to? Yeah, yeah, yeah we'll happy to do okay. that, yeah. Um, uh, we're we're going to check out another track. We're going to take a, a quick break. And um, a Big Jim out in San Diego goes, ahem, because he's a Mets fan. Hey, Jim. So, so, so we're, we're rattling some time. Uh, are you guys ready to go? We'll, we'll uh, yeah, we can do it now. Oh, yeah. Okay, so what are you going to do for us? Um, we're going to do another one from uh, from Motherland. A, a lot of the, uh, the tracks that... Um, the, Tom and I have been working on have been, uh, we use Motherland as the, uh, um, what would you call it? The the blueprint. blueprint. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Um, so uh, this is another track um, uh, called um, The Big Inside. You ready? Yeah, there you go.
So many people have uh, checked in tonight. Uh, Jim, who is the president of Arl Moon, uh, the National hey, Jim. Bar, he said uh, he wanted to give a special note to you because he met you in London a few times. He Keithy. did. Yes, he did, yeah. And, and Keith, he's such a good guy. He's yeah. a top bloke. I like him um, a lot. Yeah, and uh, uh, Jim is in actually, uh, Jim uh, Brennan is in Seattle this week. All right. And um, also Andre up in Lindhurst, New Jersey, is listening in. He says a uh, special note tonight. <laughs> Hey, Andre. Good evening, Andre. And um, also some other people check with us on Facebook, and you can uh, let us know you're listening, uh, facebook.com uh, forward slash Gagley Archive. So many people checking in tonight, loving it. Uh, Joe Dorsey is listening actually from Barrington, New Jersey. Wow, okay. And uh, Rich Matelski, uh, who's listening from Spark Hill, New York, he said, the gang's all here, bro Ambrose, uh, Paul and me, Paul back to Berkeley tomorrow. Uh, and uh, he said, uh, looking forward to uh, hearing you guys tonight as well. And Thank so you. many people, Thank you. so many people loved uh, what you guys did tonight, and a very special uh, show. Also, uh, listening to us tonight in the southern tip of South America, which is known as like the Napa Valley of South America, uh, Marcio Chiaramanti. Uh, he's listening to us tonight, and uh, with the rest of the family in Bento Gonzalez. Rio Grande uh, do Sol, Brazil. So they're all listening in tonight uh, down there. Uh, special to uh, Marcio Chiaramante and, and the rest of the family down there. They're, they're, uh, they actually have dinner parties and film listening to the Gaggy Archives on the tube radio. Cool. Wow. It's, America. it's one of the coolest videos ever. Thanks for listening, Marcio. Uh, but you guys are hanging out. You guys are yeah, going yeah, to yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, We're going to uh, get into our uh, concert list. Uh, that's right on the other side. So let's get to They, they have a, an excellent album that came out a few years back called um, uh, Quickly, Quickly, Quickly. And they were big favorites over the New Jersey Progress. We had a chance to chat with them as well. And uh, just just a, a fun, fun band to be around. And we're going to feature a cut from that album. Uh, and this one's called Mr. Freeze. And they're an excellent band to see live. A lot of fun. And um, again, we're going to be playing at the New Jersey Proghouse Concert Series. Uh, once again, njproghouse.com, and um, they uh, really do uh, one hell of a job. So uh, if you haven't seen it, go see it later today at Roxy Dukes. This is the Tea Club, Mr. Freeze. 